would I would have Barry a lot higher because that was life threatening. I would put him much higher. Eric Barry on the field for the Chiefs after the diagnosis last year, lymphoma, chemotherapy, missed most of last season. Look, this is not an ACL. This is not a finger. Eric Berry beat cancer and then came out and played an all-pro level. Hey, let's go. We dominating all day. Dominate all day. Family on two. One, two, bam. Eric Berry was a complete safety coming into the league. He played safety. He played corner. He, he was a multi-dimensional player coming into the NFL. He was the first Chiefs rookie uh, to go to the Pro Bowl uh, since Derek Thomas. on the left side of the field. It was Eric Berry. And the Chiefs going to take away. You know what, Eli? You know what, Eli? Berry's budding career would take a tragic turn midway through the 2014 season. And further tests on Chief Safety Eric Berry have confirmed the team's fears. A mass in his chest is Hodgkin's lymphoma. His doctor says it's very treatable. Barry issued a statement thanking his many well-wishers and saying he'll attack this like he does everything else in life. At that point, you're not thinking about football. You're just thinking, this guy has cancer. That's one of those words that doesn't sound right under any circumstance. Throughout his cancer treatments, Eric Barry was continuing to work out. Barry would conquer his cancer and return to the field only eight months later. The cancer survivor, Eric Berry, from chemotherapy to the Pro Bowl. When you come back from chemo in the off season and then you're a Pro Bowler the next season, to battle cancer and to go through everything that he had to go through on a personal level and get back out on the field playing professional football at a high level for a playoff team is unbelievable. Eric Berry, his second big defensive play of the game. You can put that anywhere from one to 10, but it's gotta be on the list. It's different than all the others, and it's, uh, it's so inspiring. I, I just think it's a great story.